Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're coming across an error in Google Chrome that your connection is not private. So this should hopefully be a fairly straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and just jump straight into it. So we're going to start by opening up the Start menu. Type in Control Panel. Best match should go back to control panel listed directly above app. So go ahead and just left click on that. Set your view by to category view and then select network and internet. Select network and sharing center. And now you want to go ahead and left click on where it says underneath your internet, whatever Wi Fi or Ethernet perhaps it may say. Go ahead and just left click on that. Now that we are in here, go ahead and select the properties button. Select Internet Protocol version 4, TCP slash IPv4. Select the Properties button. And now select Use the following DNS server address. And inside of this field, you want to type 8 in the first section, and then another 8, 8, 8. So you want to have four 8s in a row, all spaced out. And in the second row here for the alternate DNS server, you want to do 8.8.4.4. Exactly how it appears on my screen here. And once you're done with that, go ahead and select OK. Once you're done with that, close it here. With we'll just restarting your computer, see if that resolves the problem. And another thing you can try here is see if your clock and date settings are correct down in your taskbar. So if you were to right click on it and then select Adjust Date and Time, make sure your date and time settings are correct here. If not, you may have to switch it from setting time automatically. You may have to change your time zone as well as changing the date and time manually by selecting the Change button. So again, pretty self-explanatory there, guys. And I would suggest restarting your computer once you're done. And as always, thank you guys for watching. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.